This is BBC News, I'm Sean Lay with the latest headlines. More than 150,000 people in the UK have died since the pandemic began within 28 days of testing positive for COVID. Lawyers for Novak Djokovic claim he was given a vaccine exemption to enter Australia because he'd had a recent COVID infection. Thousands more flat owners will be spared the expense of replacing unsafe cladding under new government plans to make developers offer four billion pounds towards the cost. NASA says the James Webb Space Telescope has fully deployed in space after unfolding its final mirror panels today. Hello, good evening and welcome to BBC News. More than 150,000 people in the UK have now died within 28 days of a positive COVID test during the course of the pandemic since it began in March 2020. Another 313 deaths have been reported in the latest daily figures. That's the highest number of deaths in a 24-hour period since February of last year. The UK is the seventh country to pass the number of official deaths of 150,000 after the US, Brazil, India, Russia, Mexico and Peru. Well, our health correspondent, Catherine de Costa, came into the studio earlier to tell me about the significance of passing that milestone. It depends how.